Hello everybody, happy Sunset Musings, Dr. K here. So, today we are once again at the Botanical Gardens. And if you haven't been here, this is the time to be here. This is the, I'll show you a few things. This is uh, the sun clock, the sundial. Um, the sun is behind um, the clouds, I mean the trees, but if it wasn't, it would be showing like right around here at 7. And there is some beautiful flowers here. I'll just show you um, over there. Hello. Yeah, the, and there is some. They're actually growing vegetables in this part of the garden. And it's so beautiful. One of them here in the midst of the flowers. Check it out. It's the artichokes. Isn't that lovely how the artichokes are growing? Oops. Oh, there we go. Oh, with the sun. They even have music in the garden, it's trying to focus. So those are the artichokes. Looks like a, sometimes they get so big. Over here, we have the rose garden, little baby rose garden. Fountain. I still have to wear a mask, unfortunately, even though we're outside, but oh well. Look at this, this is the jasmine flower. smells so good oh my goodness big time jasmine mm, mm, mm. roses can never get enough roses I'll go I'll show you they have some herbs here too and this looks like lemon balm right here beautiful that one is really good for the nervous system at night to help us calm the nervous system and to sleep peacefully or more peacefully at least Ooh, this beautiful plant with the white flowers that is yerba mansa let's see oh yeah there we go yerba mansa right there anemopsis californica and what this was it's really good for inflammation the roots primarily but we can make tea out of the leaves and the yellow um the white flowers very healing plant. Okay, let's look at the veggies, you guys. This is gonna be awesome. <gasps> this is a massive artichoke. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Oh no, is that artichoke? Yes. Look at look at the size of it. Okay, I'm gonna step back. Look at the size of this artichoke. My goodness, it's taller than me. I go, I'm 5'2", and I go to live about right here. Look at that. Oh my, this is going to be beautiful. Incredible. Eggplant is a little baby eggplant here. This, I think, is... I don't quite know what this is. Mm -hmm -hmm. More artichokes over there. Oh, look at that in the back. So here we have squash, little baby squash. Ooh, lovely. Aww. Artichoke is deaf. Oh, this is rosemary, but we know rosemary. That one we can make tea out of it. Some lemon. Really good for the respiratory tract. They have tomatoes. Oh, wow. You know, um, it's the best thing to have a garden because we have two growing. Look at that piece over there. Ooh. That, that looks really yummy. This is going to be a sunflower. Oh, my gosh. These are little baby peppers over there. Do you see that? There are yellow ones and red ones. Oh, and here it looks like a corn. Oh, let's check it out. Oops. Oh, yes, that is corn. My goodness. Watermelon somewhere in here. A little baby one. There, the beautiful chart. Ooh. Oh, and they have spots of oregano right here. This looks like some chives. Oh, no, this may be even garlic. This looks like garlic. Let's smell it. Oh, that's definitely garlic. Oh, look at that. The chard is so just delicious. You know, chard, leafy green vegetables are so good for our organism. Kale, chard, mustard greens. They're harder to uh, prepare for, for most because we, 
kind of are not taught that but it's just so simple i always just get them up and saute them with some oil and a few spices oh marjoram mm, my favorite and this looks like some kind of rhubarb oh this looks like rhubarb and it's so um, nutritious for our organism these leafy greens and it's highly highly, highly alkalinizing so yeah look at that you guys and there is the beautiful sunset behind trees ah, let me go back to this beauty over here so you can see it a little better so how are you doing today I know I just oh look at these peppers oh my goodness just wanna grab one <laughs> they may be actually spicy capsicum anum <laughs> oh marigold yes I just love gardens I love nature I was thinking you know I always keep talking to you look at that beauty here I always keep talking to you about truth and how to connect to truth and I thought nature just is truth you know there's no questioning there's no judgment this is little baby looks like um, orange possibly look at that little baby tiny orange Aww. and here's our son good night son and I thought today sometimes the bigger truth is a little overwhelming so it helps I thought okay how can I just every day and in every moment choose oh I don't know if you see that but there is hummingbird right there underneath oh yes he came to say hello to us it's a little baby truth are good you know if the big one is overwhelming I am going to focus on little ones like smelling the flowers and driving slower is for me when I was coming here okay the, the truth be driving slower letting others drive in front of me um, here you know you're supposed to wear masks here so when I'm alone I don't and when I'm people around here I respect them and I do so those little things like that they pile up and then create them oh there is the hummingbird I'll let you guys enjoy him He's a little on the left there now. I was just reading most of the, actually all the hummingbirds are only in the Western Hemisphere. Arizona is the capital for hummingbirds. We have 13 species. To the right of the Mississippi River, apparently there's only one kind of hummingbird. All the other ones are on the other side which I thought was pretty profound and I talked about last time you know why are there all these yellow flowers and there's a beautiful poster there that the bees can only see yellow blue purple and ultra violet and I have purple shirt and I have had a lot of bees trying to notice me here oh, I just want to share this with you share this beautiful moment of sunset say thank you for today thank you son thank you for joining me and just remember every little thing makes a big difference every little truth is a big one in the in the big picture so good night good night son good night everybody take a care bye thank you for visiting bye bye